You've now got Mustang really going to new levels with this one right here. Let's talk about the dark horse and the iterations we've now seen threefold. Detroit, then to LA, and now we're seeing it here. What's new in Chicago? We wanted to keep something exciting for Chicago. We've been talking a little bit about dark horse and just 2024 Mustang in general, but for Chicago, we brought out the carbon fiber wheels. So with the handling pack with the dark horse, you can get the 10 and a half and 11 inch wide rear, uh, 10 and a half front, 11 in the rear, uh, carbon fiber wheels. It's an impressive look, up to 37% lighter. Um, obviously that's unsprung mass, so it's that much better in performance. You're gonna feel it through the steering wheel. And we're excited to have this design here because when people look at it, it's like that jewelry. It's that, those cool shoes that uh, this car definitely deserves. Uh, something that you just said that really stands out to me is you said something that people are really going to look at. It's like jewelry. And I think that's something unique is that what we've seen in the auto industry from a transitional standpoint over the past, let's say, 10 years is that we used to go to aftermarket brands and, and upfit our vehicles when we buy them, right? You buy a standard five liter Mustang, you'd go home, you buy your own wheels, you buy your own spoiler, you put your own ground effects package on it. Now they're coming from the factory and that's what you're doing with this Mustang right here. Talk to me about some of the aftermarket uh, attributes, if you will, on this dark horse. You know, one of the cool things is personalization with Mustang, and there's always different ways you can configure it. This exact one that we're looking at right now has the optional painted stripe. So it has the over-the-top painted stripe, which is hand-done, and it's beneath the clear coat. So that's a very, like, premium look. At the same time, you know, to the point of the handling pack, right? So this has the wider stance with the uh, carbon fiber wheels. You know, that's an option. And to your point about that kind of aftermarket look, you know, not only does it look tuned in that sense from the factory, but we've developed and tested over like 200 different styles of this wheel to make sure that it's, it lives up to our standard just like anything else with the Ford Mustang. So you know you have that factory-backed uh, you know, expertise and confidence when choosing something like this. And our guys go hard when they bring this out to the track. And we want to make sure that, you know, this is 100% track capable, and that's what the dark horse is bringing to the market is, you know, it's a five liter pinnacle performance that's really track focused. Custom hood, front spoiler, side skirts around, rear diffuser plus spoiler on the rear. We've got awesome exhaust on it, but the interior is new. We weren't able to see that in LA, right? That's correct. So this is the first time we've had a, uh, this is the first time we've had a dark horse with a complete interior. You know, we've been showing the, just the outside of the car to this point, deep indigo, uh, with bright indigo accents, you can see the stitching. The craftsmanship is definitely elevated from where we were with the previous generation Mustang. You know, that we want that perceived quality. A cockpit-focused Mustang for the first time. Usually, you know, we talk about Mustang interior with the double brow. This one, absolutely focused on the driver. And you see that, you know, that double screen. And that, you know, really digitally immersive cockpit. You know, not only does it look cool, and it is focused on the... Uh, kind of our, we say rising rebel customer, our younger customer we're looking for, but it's even powered by the same video game technology, video game drivers that they uh, have been growing up with. So, you know, it really brings it to the forefront. All right, so before we go, there's a couple different things I want Gian to, to tell us about. And one thing that you haven't brought up yet is the freaking drift brake. I mean, that is, that's it, man. The, that's the first time I've seen it. Uh, tell us why and is that an option? Now, drift brake is awesome because not only has Mustang been a champion with Vaughn Gittin Jr. in Formula Drift, now we're giving our, our enthusiasts a chance to learn and be able to drift just like the pros, right? We've modulated this drift brake so that it easy, easily can lock up the rear wheels, and we, you know, we've developed the software so you can hang it out just like the pros. And you know what? We want to make it easier. We want people to enjoy their vehicle, and bringing the factory first drift brake helps with that. John Cadiz is with the enthusiast product planning, communication side of the brand. Uh, but we're going to close it out with this. I got to bring you in. Come on. Come on. Shoes. I mean, oh. that's how you roll now when you go to an auto show. His match this. Mine, Captain America, baby.